Hi, this is John on behalf of Expert Village. In this video clip, I'll be showing you the parts of an air compressor. First off is the tank pressure gauge. That's located right here. It goes directly into the tank. This is going to tell you the actual pressure inside of the tank. Next, we have our on-off lever. When you turn it on, the air compressor is going to fill up to a specified pressure and it's going to automatically turn itself off even though the switch will still be in the on position. Now when you use your air compressor and your pressure gets low, the switch is going to stay on and the air compressor will automatically kick on, fill back up, and then turn itself off all while the switch is still in the on position. Next we have our regulator pressure gauge and our regulator. This is going to allow us to set different pressures. For example, if a tool needs a little bit higher pressure, we can set this higher. Or if another tool needs a lower pressure, we can back it off and relieve some of the pressure until it gets to what we need. Here we have our coupler. This is what our hose is going to plug in and on the other end of our hose will be a tool. Over here we have our pump oil fill dipstick and our pump oil drain is located at the bottom. Lastly, we have our drain valve and our pressure relief valve.